Got him! Woohoo! <laughs> What's going on, folks? Thanks for joining me on another episode of Duck Gun Chronicles. Out here for early goose opener. And we're freaking pumped again. We're out here in the silage, ready to go. We got the whole crew in here. What's going on, guys? What's up, you man? getting blinded? <laughs> oh, yeah. We're all ready. We're all stoked. So we'll be happy. Can't complain. So stay tuned, guys. We'll see you guys when the birds start flying. No, I don't think so. We shot them over top. How many? Is it just one? <laughs> Well, that first, the one on the left or the right side, all of us just shot. I wonder why they didn't. I was, I thought about letting them try to go over, but I'm like, man, they're low. If they flare, like, we better just take what we get. But they hit it right there. I thought they were going to come down, and they didn't do it for us. I think there's some over the river tucked back in. Well, guys. they just hooked they around us. Around them. Let's try them, I guess. Try them right here, okay? Take them. Where that two pack go? They're flying over the trees over there. Well, we better go get them. Yeah, let's go get them. Let's be going, get going, huh? Where's the other one? There's one walking way back there. Is the new pack coming? It sounds like it, I have no idea. Just run for him, Darren. I think the best hunt out of this field is yet to come. I think by next weekend, is, if we didn't hunt it. I heard what you did. Yeah, There's an old lady. Right when I was talking. Oh, there's one coming down the field. 
Got him! Woohoo! I would have told you guys shot. <laughs> hey, you know that crumpled him going away. He was already bleeding. He was dying anyhow. Nah, he was going out of the field. I <laughs> They're hooking, hooking, hooking. <laughs> you ready to take them? Take them. Take them. I was getting ready to tell you, Jordan, you got a call and I can't it. see it. How many we get? Four? Two. We said two take right it. I jumped up and then nobody went. Where was the two in front of you guys? Are those too far when you said take it? They, they had already went past. Oh, my bad. Way too long. I was waiting for Devin and he didn't say nothing, so I started yelling. I couldn't see him. That's my bad. I'll call it next time. Yeah, it's all the way down the right. I can't see nothing. That's my bad. All right, folks. Well, some geese coming in. Not quite finishing as close as we'd hope, but still giving us some uh, some shots. So we're getting some down, having a good time. There's a goose. What do you think, Devin? Can't complain. There's a goose right there coming into the field. Are you serious? Yeah. One another solo. <laughs> All right, here we go. Well, that is a wrap on the opener day hunt. We did get out the day after that. We had some F.A. Sillows and the sub three man blind out on the river um, for <laughs> a set in the evening. Um, or no, that was morning. But either way, uh, all that for one goose coming in. Um, the GoPro died by the time it came in, but I did get it on shot cam. So not a skunk, not a skunk. Um, but this has definitely been a um, slower start to the season. Um, but I did want to share with you guys kind of my favorite products for early season goose. Um, and, and like I said, I, I've been running the FA Silos for a while now. Those are awesome. Definitely beat out um, using full bodies in my opinion, especially early season you put out a lot of out there a lot of a lot of decoys out there without taking a lot of space or a lot of time um so those fa silos are a game changer not only that but on the river me and devin were talking about how having like an a-frame out there and we had the fa sub three blind out there it's just a game changer getting that hide um so if you want to check out those products guys you can go to finalapproach.com and use code duck gun over there and you get 10 per 10% off. So check that out. Um, guys, I'm going to do my best to get you guys an awesome goose hunt in the early season. Hopefully, still got a chance. Hopefully, we'll make it happen. But um, that's all I got for today, guys. I'm Jordan, Duck and Chronicles, and we'll see you guys on the next one.